Hey, how's it going everyone? My name is Ivan Martinez and I'm the Executive Director for Rebel City PAL. Here is my colleague and Associate Director Enrique Calderon. Um, I quickly wanted to share with you guys uh, sort of the importance and the reason why we decided to partner with Fit Kids um, because one, their leader is a tremendous leader and has been doing this work here in the community for such a long, long time and so have we. Um, but most importantly, uh, the flexibility and the adaptability of their curriculum um, and, and their program, th their staff, uh, like I said, curriculum, their, their tools, their trainings, everything, to be able to be sort of handed something uh, to an organization like ours where uh, we're already running a million and one programs uh, on the education and enrichment side. Uh, we know how important it is to include the fitness and the into this uh, holistic approach to youth development. And so the hardest thing sometimes is to figure out how are we cramming so many things in and how do we have the right people teaching the right stuff or the right coaches and uh, how, we, how do we know we're doing this right? So to have Fit Kids literally hand us a roadmap and all the support that we need to be able to execute on something like this and the benefit uh, for the kids has been a, a tremendous uh, a blessing and opportunity for us. So thank you, Fit Kids. And I wanted to pass this along to Enrique so he can tell you more about, on the program side, what we've been able to do. Yeah, so um, in terms of program, uh, here at Redwood City Pal, we run an after-school program um, every day of the week, Monday through Friday, where we have roughly around 130 to 150 kids come through our building um, on any given day. And during that time here, they get homework support, academic tutoring, um, as well as participate in a lot of enrichment activities such as uh, robotics and digital literacy, uh, music production, art, Afro-Brazilian drumming, theater and drama. So adding fit and kids to our program was, was really exciting because like Ivan said, we want to make sure that our kids and our community are also staying uh, physically healthy. And so um, during our week in our program, we have Fit Kids implemented on two days um, where the kids and the mentors who lead the, they're the leaders of that, that group, they'll take them out and they'll follow the curriculum and they'll get the kids running, they'll get the kids active and, and making sure that they stay healthy as well. All right, so welcome to Redwood City Pal. Uh, as you can see here, we have our mural. This really tells our story um, here at Pal, uh, starting off with uh, the police department wanting to offer sports after school with kids um, and then really connecting with the community. Here in Redwood City, we were established uh, in 1995 and then we've evolved over time taking on sports, um, recently taking on uh, things like the music festival here in Redwood City, a golf tournament that helps fund some of the programs here at Redwood City Cal. And then we wanted to add a little bit more of a feel for the kids here at PAL. Um, and so we went with the slogan, Be Your Own Superhero. And so that makes sure to, to remind the kids that they are their own superheroes and we want to give them the opportunities to like really unlock that through our, through our programming. And so as we've evolved and developed, we offer an after-school program where we offer things like homework tutoring, academic support, we offer um, coding and robotics classes, we have uh, sports, we still manage sports for a few schools here in Redwood City. Um, we also have music production classes, we have coding classes, art classes, um, and recently we've, we've really expanded and we're excited because we're able to have uh, theater and drama classes as well as an Afro-Brazilian drumming class. Um, so the kids are really excited about that. Um, all while making sure that we make sure that we, we have the kids and the families uh, healthy and, and active in the community and at home. So we do offer um, the Fit Kids curriculum, which our mentors um, have the kids do on a, on a weekly basis. And then at the same time, we have space where we're hoping once things get safe again, we're able to bring families in as well and really support them and get families healthy with their kids at the same time so that we can make sure it's a, it's a really good environment for, for the whole family.